Hi, it's Corrine for Wild Orchid Crafts, and I'm so excited to share with you my first design team project. I have made a little mini album here, and I will have all the product codes for all the flowers and products that I used in the description box below. So if there's anything specific that you're looking for, just check out the description box and everything will be listed there. Also at the very end of this video, I do have a start to finish on how I made this. So if you're interested in seeing that, then stay tuned. And at the end of that, I will also go over all the product codes um, on the products that I used. But let me just give you a quick overview on this album. This is a four and a quarter by six. It has four pages along with the front and back cover. So there's six pages. And I just had my husband drill out the holes for the binding and I added some seam binding to hold it together. I painted this album in white acrylic paint and then I did spray it with some cotton candy pink in Lindy Stamp Gang. It gives it a gorgeous iridescence to it. On the front here I used the gorgeous open mannequin. This is um, GST 066 and they sell beautiful cutouts. They have the mannequin, they have bird cages, little hummingbirds, they have clocks, tons to choose from. And currently Wild Orchid Crafts is running a 15% off sale. So again, the link to Wild Orchid Crafts will be in the description box below. I use some of the chrysanthemums here. I used a couple of the beautiful tulips. There's some hip rosebuds here throughout. These here are the wild rose. They have these in all different types of colors. And then there's also some cherry blossoms. I use some of the white leaves throughout. And I do also have some of their white spray stamens. And what I like about these is you get a pack of 12 but you can cut them in two or three. I think this one's cut in three different pieces. And I have, yeah, I have the extra piece down in here. So these last quite a while. And again, check out the description box or at the end of the video where I go over everything on this. On the side here, I have some white seam binding ribbon. That is what binds my little book together. But what I did is I tied a double bow and hot glued that directly onto the album. And you may not see that on the video, but that's just for looks. Then there is also a second bow on here that can be untied once photos are added if you need a little more room in the binding. So again, um, these here are just for looks. I love the look of seam binding on this album. So on the inside, these pages I cut from chipboard and I edged them in white acrylic paint. And then I added the beautiful London Market Pink Paisley collection. And I did distress all the edges with the Tim Holtz distressing tool and added a little bit of the white picket fence around some of the pages and also a little bit of vintage photo. And then there's a few of these pages that have pockets in them. On the back side of the front of my cover, I used one of the gorgeous organza rose trim from Wild Orchid Crafts. I absolutely love this. And a couple of the cherry blossoms. The pages I left blank until I add photos and then I will probably go back and add some um, more flowers to them. So here's a couple of the tags. Added a few pearls on these. And on the last page there's a tag as well. So I hope you've enjoyed this project. Check out the video for the start to finish on how I did this if you're interested. And check out Wild Orchid Craft. They have the most amazing products out there. Thanks so much for stopping by.
So I hope you've enjoyed the start to finish on this and here is the album. I'd like to share with you some of the products used in it and the product codes. Here are the chrysanthemums and it's set C QVR031 and these come in several um, packages and colors. I used on the inside here one of the cream cherry blossoms and that is MKX056. I used a pale pink cherry blossom which is MKX050. I used several of the hip rosebuds which is GST014. Spiral, the white spiral stamens which is MKX576. I did use some of the white leaves as well with the stem, 30 millimeter. These are MKX450. Here are the wild rose. These are the 30 millimeter QVR026. The tulips. These are the pastel MKX212. Here's this gorgeous, gorgeous organza rose trim. It's MKX366. I use some of the pearl sprays that they have, which I love. These are MKX539. Uh, you won't be able to see that, but uh, these will be in the description box below. And lastly, I used the open mannequin here and it's GST 066. If you have any questions, please leave me a comment and stay tuned for the detailed photos. Thanks for watching.